Hey, what's up guys and girls, this is Jano and I'm going to show you the intro of the new update that's coming up for everybody. Obviously it's going to be a slow rollout and um, I'm just going to just show you the basic controls of the Buddy Buddy system with this update. Um, as you can see I've already, I've already got my Snorlax on there which I'm going to switch around anyway because I haven't actually done any walking at the moment. But uh, yeah, it's pretty impressive. I mean, you can just see by how big the Snorlax is or whenever you decide to actually choose a different um, Pokemon to put on there. Um, click on the, buddy sister, on the Buddy icon and you can see everything that you need to do. On the bigger Pokemons, obviously it's 5k. Pretty sure the smaller Pokemons, which you will see in a, a short while, that it's going to be a 3k um, walk instead of 5, five kilometers. Um, uh, there you go. If you decide that you wanted to change while you were doing um, some walking already, you will clearly lose the progress that you've got going on with that certain Pokemon. Um, what else have we got to talk about was this is going on like this. Uh, we're going to switch it up to Ivysaur. Yeah, we're going to go and check out the Ivysaur now and um, <clears throat> switch it up from the Snorlax to Ivysaur just so that you can see what it actually looks or what the big difference is with the bigger Pokemons which are fully evolved. Obviously Snorlax don't have any more evolution, didn't have any evolution anyway, but we're going to go back to the smaller Pokemon which is the Ivysaur so that you can actually see um, the big difference and uh, I'm pretty sure you can tell by now that you can switch whatever, whatever buddy you've got walking around with you. So we're switching over to the buddy system and the Ivysaur should come up. The phone is working a bit slow there because there's a lot of things going on at the same time. And there's the Ivysaur as my buddy walking around. The, uh, well, not walking around because you can't actually see him walking around with me. But as you can see, it's pretty simple. The, the me mechanisms of the actual uh, buddy system that they're, they're bringing up on the update. Um, but it, look, it does look a lot cooler. It feels a lot better as well, even though I haven't done any actual walking with them yet. From my personal experience, I'm pretty sure a lot of you are already looking forward to this. And if you can't wait for the update to come up, then you can always go on the internet and download the APK, because that's how I've managed to get mine. Um, obviously, I didn't go through Google, the Google system. I just went on the internet and you'll get like, um, uh, the APK version 37 I think it was 0 0.37 and then uh, download that <clears throat> when you go to download it you'll get the um, you'll get a message saying that um, it's, it's going to be a harmful for your phone or device that you're using which obviously isn't going to be harmful because it's made by Nantic and uh, they're going to try to screw you over or screw anyone over or mess anyone around um, yeah, I'm just going to try to get rid of this uh, little chat that we've got going on here. Yeah. Ivysaur didn't like that as well, he's like, go away! So yeah, um, as you can see, you've got the full anima animation of the uh, um, Ivysaur and any of the Pokemons that you put on there. And uh, you can still see what you've got, go what your name and um, all your progressions and all that stuff. Um, we're just going to quickly go and look on the, uh, on the actual uh, uh, avatar of the person while he's walking or he's on the, on the map. As you can see you can't see your actual Pokemon next to you walking around as some people probably presume that you would have been able to do. Um, but you can see a little picture of your cute Pokemon next next to your actual profile picture which is at the bottom left as, you, as, as shown on my screen. Um, that's pretty much it. I mean I'm just going to scroll through now and uh, uh, show what other stuff you can do. Also, I'm just going to switch back over to my Snorlax because when I do decide to go for that 5k walk, which I'm pretty sure I'm going to be doing either sometime today or tomorrow because uh, work and all that stuff. Plus, I do actually want to chill out and not just constantly be playing Pokemon, even though I would love to. But yes, <laughs> that's. Um, responsibilities everybody don't forget that <laughs> uh, 
So now you get to see me switch back over from the Ivysaur back to my original Pokemon that I first chose to uh, want, want to actually uh, get some candies for it. Um, as far as I'm, I'm aware, you're only getting one, ca one candy per, um, per 5k walk that you do. Um, I can't see, like I said, I've not actually tested this out fully yet, so I can't see you getting any more than one candy. And I'm pretty sure it's, all, it's also on the update notes that it's only one candy per Pokemon, per, per however many kilometers you actually have to walk them. Uh, also, the lower the lower uh, Pokemons, well, you're probably like the first, ev um, before you evo ev evolution them to the uh, second evolution, you'll probably um, only have to do the 2k walk, and then obviously from second to, to from first to second is 2k, then second to third it's probably going to be three three k to um to five k but this is where i say goodbye and hopefully i haven't confused you too much and this is my nice little snorlax collection so <laughs> if anyone out there actually have met me in the in places that um we've all been playing around in then you're, you're more than welcome to uh, try to put your name to towards one of the uh, Snorlax that I've got if you don't already have one and uh, we can, I'm sure I can trade you some of them, just not the strongest one. See you later guys and girls.